I've seen a lot of change, been through a lot of pain. Some things are not the same as they were a year ago. But all will be okay. I move on each and every day. The past is where it stays, way back a year ago. I've changed for the better this time. I thought I would never be fine. I strive just to say I'm alright. And for the first time in a long time, I'm alright. I've seen a lot of change, been through a lot of pain. Some things are not the same as they were a year ago. But all will be okay. I move on each and every day. The past is where it stays. Way back a year ago. All right, let's do the next one, which will work your neck muscles to correct forward head posture. Slightly bend your knees, lean upper body forward, and place both hands on your head, press downward. Tuck in your chin and tighten your neck. Try to lift your head up against the pressure from your head. Okay, the next one will be lean shoulder external rotation. This will help to fix round shoulders and tight chop straps. Lie on your side with your head rested on pillow. Keep your upper arm tightly against your side and fix the elbow position at 90 degrees throughout this process. You can do this one with a dumbbell or a water bottle which can give you a big difference. Please remember to tighten your upper arm all the time and fix the elbow position at 90 degrees. Okay, let's do slippers stretch next. Put your elbow and shoulder in a straight line. Use your other hand to push the forearm down to the floor. Please press as far down as you comfortably can. Alright, let's switch side. If you have sloping shoulders or your top traps show a bump-like structure, then apart from relaxing tight muscles, you might also need to pay attention to your shoulder blades. Like shoulder depression, it can cause the inner part of the shoulder blades to protrude and pushes your top traps up. This exercise will help your shoulders go back to the normal position and give you a better looking shoulder line. Alright, it's time to stretch the tight shoulder. Please do it slowly and at your comfortable level. Okay, we have planks next. Engage your core and make sure your body in a straight line. If you want to be more challenging, you can lift your legs alternately. This exercise will train the back muscles to reduce the strain on up traps and also correct the shoulder blades position by working the serratus anterior muscles. Okay, let's sit up to stretch our levator scapulae. 
If they're too tight, the chaps will be lifted up by the shoulder blades. Place your left arm behind your back. Tilt your right ear towards the right shoulder. Then look back at the floor. You can also place your right hand on your head to give some pressure. Ok, switch sides. Place your right hand behind your back, tilt your left ear towards your left shoulder, then look back at the floor. Alright, the next one is wall angels, which is meant to flex your shoulders and work the muscles of your upper back. Bend your knees slightly with your head, shoulders, and lower back flat against the wall. Tap in your shoulder blades and move your arms up and down against the wall. The chaps actually contain three components, the upper part of shoulder, the center, and the lower part of the inner area of shoulder blade. Generally, because of the weak middle and the lower traps, the top traps get overworked and tightened. This exercise can train the middle and the lower traps really well to resolve the tight top traps. You can lift your arms halfway up if you cannot lift them up fully. Alright, the next we will stretch the chest muscles. Overtense the chest muscles can cause round shoulders, shifting shoulder blade position, and tighten top traps. Place your right arm against the wall with the elbow at the shoulder height. Take one step forward using the same side leg and tuck in your shoulder blade. You can feel the stretch in your pectoralis major. Ok, relax. The arms against the wall and elbows higher than the shoulders hit. Take a step forward with the same leg and lean your body away from the wall. You can feel the stretch in your pectoralis minor. Alright, relax your shoulders and let's change to other side. The elbow shouldn't be lower your shoulder. Make sure to open your chest and tuck your shoulder blades in. Okay, relax. Lift your arms higher a little bit. Lean forward and taste your body away from the wall. Alright, the last step, let's relax our top traps with on the side wall. Lean against the wall like this and roll the massage ball at the tensed area. Ok, switch sides and massage the same way as before. You can also massage your tight chest or back with this ball.
Okay, that's all for today. Hope you guys enjoy it. See you soon next week. Bye.